how y'all doing? Okay, so today I'm coming at you with the review on a super cute men's crossbody bag that I first saw whenever I was, um, you know, stalking the Mick MN. This is the Torres in the Macassar MM. Now there is a PM size, and it, but it's not shaped like this, but smaller. It's actually this has the silhouette of, uh, you know, the uh, Amazon, the smaller one, or the Danube. It looks like that. So like the Mick, it had their PM size is just a smaller version. Uh, this is the MM, and the PM is a smaller version of this. Whereas the PM of this is a completely different silhouette. It's like half. It looks like that. It's like half. Anyway, um, it's really cute. Like I said, it's the monogram print. It's the Macassar, so it has the um, you know black leather accents on it. Really cute. Um, it's got on the bottom here. See, it's got the silver um, hardware. Chunky. First, let me give you the measurements. Okay, so from the bottom, because it does taper just slightly. So at the very bottom, from you know where it curves to where it curves, right here, is 14 inches. And then at the top, okay, so you can see how it kind of curves around right here. So at the top, and I just did like right here at the little, there's actually like a, a seam. See that little seam? So I just measured from seam to seam. And that is 13 inches. And then it's 11 inches tall. And then it's about five inches deep. Okay, so I just kind of, I didn't actually measure this piece necessarily. I mean, I did, but then I also, you know, my test is, what actually sits flat on the table and it's about five inches so it's a pretty roomy bag and then it also has the uh, cotton webbed adjustable strap that has the Louis Vuitton embossed in the strap um, and it's it's adjustable like I said I don't I didn't measure the smallest and longest but let me just say it will fit any height literally you could make it super short if you're a shorter person you can extend it way up if you're a taller person I'm five six you know, I've told y'all I like for my backs to hang a little bit lower, you know, kind of pat, like right there at my hip bone. Um, and so anyway, yeah, I didn't measure that part. But anyway, the inside is, and I'm going to take this out. I think I've told y'all about these smelly goods. It's actually for a car, but it smells like leather. And so it makes the inside of your back smell like leather. So if you're sensitive to fragrance, consider one of those. Okay, anyway, so the inside is that really pretty hardy canvas material in the burgundy color. And so on the back wall, so you've got your heat stamp right here. You have two decent sized pockets right here. And I forgot to bring, I'm up at the shop doing this video and I forgot to bring my little demo cell phones. But anyway, I can tell you that, you know, you cannot fit your phone side to side. If you fit it, or if you put it in this way, it's gonna stick out a little bit, but they still are the generous pockets. Oh, you can't really, can't get the lighting in there. You get the idea, right? It's not the cell phone pockets or the small one. It's actually pretty decent. And then on, okay, so this is kind of strange. I was gonna say that this is the back wall, but then you have, okay, whatever. On the opposite wall, on the outside, you have an exterior pocket. It's very roomy, so you can fit your keys and your cell phone and you know whatever else you want in there, gum or what have you. Um, okay, so what was I gonna tell you? There was something specific and I just lost my train of thought. Sorry. Um, like I said, I was stocking this bag because I, you know, was really wanting like a crossbody bag and I wanted something with silver. And so you can see this has the silver hardware. This one, unlike my Mick, has a dual zipper option. And I really like that. Oops, sorry. Got to get these twisted around. And then it's, so it's also the chunky, the chunky zippers. So it's not only, so it's two things I love. Actually three. It's got the chunky actual zipper track. It's got the chunky zipper pulls, which I like, and there's two of them. I just really, I don't know why I like that so much, but I do. If you've been watching my videos, you hear me say that all the time. And then this one out here is just like a little bit smaller than the other ones, but um, it's still, I just like it. I guess just because, well, I'm not going to get into that because then it makes me sound like I'm super old. Um, my, my dexterity, y'all, it's not the same. I can't just be picking up small things anymore, you know? Like those days are gone. I need something hardy to pull on. You know what I'm saying? Okay, there, sorry. Okay, so let me show you what fits in it because as you know, it fit the same thing in every bag. Um, and like I said, I well, I didn't wanna turn this into a comparison video, but I'm, I'm going to kind of. So like I said, this is the, the Mick MM, okay? And it's funny because if you see the measurements, and even I said it in my video on it, it's 14 by 12 by three. 
So it's the same width from here to here, but it's also the same going all the way up. So it doesn't even taper. And I know it looks like it does because it kind of slouches. But the shape that it is at the bottom is the shape that it is at the top. It's like a, whoa, don't fall. It's like a rectangle. So it doesn't have a curved top like the Torres. See how the Torres curves? The mic just goes straight out. So you wouldn't think that that makes much of a difference, but it does because there's more room to get into on this one. It's almost like a shoulder tote, uh, which is why I like it. It also has the outside pocket, just like the Torres, which I like. Um, now I'm gonna be honest, I have been using this mic as a daily bag and I really wanted to consider it as a travel bag. But really, the Torres is a better travel size because it's just a teeny bit smaller. And even though I said the measurement's okay, five inches deep, and I said this is three inches deep, y'all, this ain't no three inches deep, okay? Because it slouches. See how you can see the bend in it right here? So, fine, if you measure from the stitching to the stitching, yes, that is three inches, okay? But this bag, when I set it on a table, look, you can see how it slouches down. So what actually is sitting on my hand is about five inches. So even though I say, I try to remember exactly what I said in my video, I do know that I told you it, it kind of poofs out. But if you go to the website or any other, you know, pre-loved website and you look at the measurements, it will say three inches. And you might be going, oh, that is really thin. It ain't no three inches, y'all. Look at that. In fact, when I put all my stuff in this one, this one seemed smaller. This one seemed more compact. This one does, I mean, I guess my stuff technically does have assigned spots, but it's even more so in this bag. So again, this one to me is a better travel option just because it is just a teeny bit smaller and because it does kind of take, you know, uh, curve at the top, which just makes it a little more, I don't know, compact, I guess. Um, and then also, oh, so the mic actually comes with the same type of strap, okay? It comes with the webbed like this and see how it's attached Okay, so it's attached, let me put this, put that bag down. Okay, so it's attached like this, and then, you know, it comes up, and there's not, I mean, I know this goes back and forth, and so that's fine, but what happens is, you know, these can get twisted. So you get it down, and you're trying to pick up the bag, see, and then it's all twisted. And I didn't like that because, number one, puts a lot of stress on the tab, this tab, but it also puts a lot of stress on this part. And, you know, I know, whatever, you could probably send it in and get a new one or whatever, but what I did, and this is, I actually have a video on this, is I um, had my leather, I have, a, I have a friend that has a leather works business, and I had him make me a leather strap, and I bought swivel hooks, see, and I put them on here. That way, um, it's a lot easier, and there's less stress being put on these tabs. Now, I will tell you that because the hook, or the hardware right here is square, it still can get a little wonky. See, like it'll kind of, kind of sort of get stuck, not as much. And so if, if my mic had the same rounded, like a true D-ring like this, um, you wouldn't have that because anytime you pick it up, it's just going to automatically slide over. But what happens with, even with the swivel hook is it'll get caught in the bend in the right angle of the hardware there. And so it's still kind of, see, like, you know, well, it doesn't do it all the time. Um, anyway, but I liked the strap. I like the look of this strap better. And if I, if I were going to get the Torres, this bag right here, I would do the same thing. Oops, excuse me. I would do the same thing. I would just have, I would just take this strap off and, or have them take it off. And I would just put another one on there that doesn't have so much, that doesn't offer so much stress. Um, I'm sorry, I got distracted and my sentence wasn't making sense. If I was going to get this bag, I would do the same thing. I would have a leather strap made. And um, in fact, you know what? I can just, you're not going to be able to tell, but I can take the strap off of my mitt and I can put it on there and just kind of show you. Now um, I was able to keep the original strap just like this and I bought small, a smaller size of swivel hooks and he was able to repair um, this strap you know because you had to obviously unstitch it to take it off and he was able to fix it and so now instead of being attached to it directly on the hardware it's attached to a hook so point is I can still use the original strap because I'm probably going to hand this, my mic down to my son when he's of age, of age, which is an age that I determine. And um, I'm sure he'll prefer, you know, the strap that came with it versus this, this black leather strap. Or he may not, I don't know. But anyway, that, the point is just that you can still use it. I just didn't want to have it just sitting. So anyway, so see, you could put this on here, but look, see how it has the curved um, hardware, the D-ring? So now, any way that you put this bag down, your, your hook 
is going to swivel back and forth plus swivel this way and you won't you won't you won't ever have oh, crap. this is getting caught in there it's driving me crazy there you go you're never gonna have it getting wonky oops like it was before because you've got this swivel hook going and then you've got a lot of give right here on the curved part and that's where my mix still kind of has a problem is because it's a you know it's a square shape and it's got the right angles it makes it a little harder but anyway um you know it does look good with this other strap because obviously it matches um and i like it but anyway let me do a mod shot for you because my video is already getting too long i don't really want to go through um what fits in it because okay I say that. Let me just let me just put stuff in here just so I can show you before it gets too long. My accessory pochette. Boom. Done. Uh, my oversized calendar. Way over here. My Zippy organizer wallet. Just a teeny bit uh, bigger than the Zippy wallet. The traditional Zippy wallet. My mid-size pochette. I have it side by side. Um, my accessory pochette. And then I have, you know, my little balm that I just put here in the corner. I have my pin case. Now, I do have a couple of odds and ends that I'm not going to dig out because I don't want to make the video super long. But anyway, everything fits in here side to side. Nothing is, you know, has to go up and down. There's still some room in here. Um, but like I said, I've just been kind of used to using the mic, and it's just a teeny bit bigger. Um, and it, the only thing I probably don't like about it is the fact that it, when you set it down, it does kind of slouch, okay, versus the uh, Torres. It's not going to do that because this uh, piece right here is pretty solid. So it's not really going to do that. Okay, let me do my shot. And like I said, I'm 5'6", so you have to see, you have to get the, the strap straight. That's what I'm talking about. All right, so this is super cute. So this is front. Let me zip it up just a tad. There. Okay, this is front, okay? And I have it, so here's my waist, and here's, where's my hip bone? My hip bone's right here. So I got my waist right here, and so that's how low I like it. I like my crossbody bags to fit, just like that. And then sometimes, like, you know, if I'm at the store, I don't like it right here going badunga, badunga on my leg like that. So I flip it around and do it right here. That way it can go badunga on my butt, and that's fine. There's more cushion back there. So, anyway, that's how it looks from the side, even from the front again. Okay, and then here it is. And then if you wanted to just um, make this a little bit longer, I was going to show you just as a shoulder. Okay, let me just adjust it a little bit. Okay, a little bit shorter, and I can totally just put it over my shoulder like that and wear the shoulder bag, which is what I did with my mic. And I literally wear it half and half, half on my shoulder and half crossbody. It just depends on where I'm at and what I'm doing. But I love this. I love the uh, combination. I love the Makassar line. I love the black accents. And I just, I just really like this bag. And I, you know, like I told you, my strap right now is uh, leather, and so I think it really looks good with this. Another thing, I really wasn't a fan of the webbed uh, um, strap because, you know, eventually it kind of peels, not peel like peeling skin, but peels like a sweater, and I don't like that. But it is sharp though, right, because it's got this. Anyway, okay, so it's getting too long. I need to cut it off now, so here we go. Torres Macassar uh, MM. I'm oh, sorry, Torres MM. Macassar. I don't know if I'm saying it all correctly, but there you go. Hope this was helpful, and I'll be talking to you real soon. Okay, bye!